Hello, welcome back. In this video, we will solve the exponent problem given on the screen. And in this video, we have to find the value of x. Let's write the question that is under root 2, again under root 2, and under root 2 is equal to 8 raised to the power x. Now, if you can see on the left hand side, the first two is has one root the second two has two roots and the third two has three roots so if we expand this expression we can write the first two is under only one root the second two is under two roots and the third one is under three roots and that is equal to 8 raised to the power x. Now this kind of expression under root 2 can be written as 2 raised to the power 1 by 2. All right. The second 2 can be written as 2 raised to the power 1 by 2 and the power can be multiplied again by 1 by 2 because there are two roots here. Accordingly, the third two will have powers 1 by 2 multiplied by 1 by 2 and multiplied by 1 by 2, which is equal to 8 raised to the power x. Then we have 2 multiplied by 1 by 2, then 2, sorry, 2 raised to the power 1 by 2, then 2 raised to the power here we'll multiply the denominator, so 1 by 4, and then 2 raised to the power 1 by 8, 2 into 2 into 2, which is equal to 8 raised to the power x. Now, for this expression, to multiply all these three exponents, we will write the base, that is 2, and we will add the powers. So we simply add 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 8, which is equal to 8 raised to the power x. Now, 2 is the base and the power or the exponent can be added. So this is an addition of fraction. So 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 8. We take the LCM of the denominator, that is 8. Now, this 8 is divided by 2, which is 4, and then multiplied by 1. It will stay 4. Then this 8 is divided by 4, that is 2, multiplied by 1, becomes 2. 8 is divided by 8, which is 1, and multiplied by this 1 is 1. So 4, 2, 6, plus 1, 7 by 8. So what do we see? Uh, the power on 2 is 2 to the power 7 by 8. And this expression is equal to 8 raised to the power x. Now, the bases are different. As you can see, on the left-hand side, we have base 2. On the right-hand side, we have base 8. That's why what we will do next is uh, we will leave the left-hand side as it is. But the right-hand side, 8, can be written as 2 raised to the power 3, which is the same thing, 2 into 2 into 2, which is 8. And then it is raised to the power x as given here. All right. So it can further be written as 2 raised to the power 7 by 8 is equal to 2. And we multiply the powers here. That is 3x. And now you can see the bases are same. So we can equate the exponents. As the bases are same, this gives the idea that exponents 3x is equal to 7 by 8. Yeah. Now, if we divide the, um, this whole term by 3, what do we get? 3x divided by 3 on the left hand side and then on the right hand side 7 by 8 and then as we have to divide by 3, we'll write in the denominator. And then we can cancel these 
3 in the left hand side and what are we left with 7 by 8 3 is a 24 so we can see on the left hand side we have x that is equal to 7 by 24 and that is our answer x is equal to 7 by 24 thank you so you can replace uh, the x here by 7 by 24 and that's the correct answer